What is it that is so special? Uh, I would imagine you could go and work pretty much wherever you wanted to go, but you, you seem to be really entrenched in this way. Well, you know, and I don't talk about this often, but I would have to say my wife, Ashley, uh, is probably as responsible for me being here than any other person. Uh, she's been extremely supportive. You know, we were in Houston, and the decision to come to Birmingham was not a light one. Uh, I had uh, some opportunities, uh, one in specific, uh, that came about at the exact same time that this commissioner's job came open. And I remember her sitting me down and said, if not you, then who? And what has the last 20 years been for? You know, why would we take our talent that we've groomed for the past 20 years and let somebody else benefit when there is a need for it in the Southwestern Athletic Conference? So, you know, that brief talk that she sat me down and said, I'm behind you and supporting you 100% is ultimately one of the main reasons why I'm here. So yes, there's been other opportunities, but family, uh, tradition, I've said this in, in numerous uh, outlets. You know, I grew up on Alcorn State Campus. Mother and father both went to Alcorn. Father got his master's uh, from Jackson State. My sister went to Southern University. I attended Prairie View. My two sons went to Texas Southern. One is still there, one graduated. He's now at Jackson State and my wife is from Grambling. So we pretty much covered the entire gamut. And my wife isn't here. I told her I had two girlfriends, one at Alabama a and one at Alabama State. So you know, that kind of pretty much and had one at Valley. So we cover all 10, uh, but I'm swacked through and through. And like she said, if not me, then who? And if not now, then when? So I'm 110% committed. Uh, this is what my life training has been about. This is what my career has been about. And I'm not going to let it fail. I'm not going to let it be just a happenstance in time. We're going to go somewhere. We're going to go somewhere fast. And we're going to make sure that the Southwestern Athletic Conference is solidified as being the best conference in Division One. You seem to have a, a policy agenda, so to speak, when you got here. Uh, you wanted to shore things up uh, with the exposure. You, you've had personal conversations with media members. Like, you, you took the temperature of the room when you got here. Well, I think that's the only way that you can go. Uh, I listen to outside uh, information. I listen to inside information. And, you know, we want all constituents of the Southwestern Athletic Conference to have input in the direction that we're going. I can't do it alone. Uh, I'm not that smart. So there are very varying amount of people that will come and give us information. And we want all of that information. But again, it's our conference. I'm, you know, my title is commissioner, but I'm regular old Charles, right? So let's go, let's listen, let's do this thing together. Let me hear what people want and let's go out and try to get it done. And that's really the philosophy that I had as athletics director at Prairie View, Texas Southern. I work for you coaches, I work for you uh, staff. You tell me what you need. It's my responsibility to go out and get you what you need. And then we're gonna hold you responsible for delivering the product. Same process here. I'm listening to the schools, I'm listening to the fans. You tell us what you want, what you need. And it's our responsibility to deliver.